everyone. Welcome again to Easy Giddy's Closet. So today, it's been a while since I've spoken to you or did a little demo on clothes or fashion or anything like that. Um, so what I'll do today is um, I'll show you a shirt that I bought um, with my last trip now to Thailand. And the idea to this is to make you aware of that if sometimes you've got a top that is more summery, but if you just change it a little bit, you can actually wear it in winter as well. So the versatility of changing your same item from summer to winter time. Um, and also the design is a very, very interesting design. Quite a big cut to it, um, but that um, makes it quite nice and interesting um, to wear. So here is the top that I bought. You can see it's a very, very big design. Very big cut flare, flare arms and to that side and there at the back. Um, the color is gray. Sometimes you see an outfit that is very nice or a top or something that's special and it's very nice, you like it, but it's not necessarily your color. Doesn't matter, what you can do is you can just um, add to it. Um, so for instance, if it's not your color, don't wear it close to your neck. Then what you should do is just put something around your neck to break the color. Um, and to bring some more color to your neck when it is to gray you can I mean you can do your pinks you can do your reds if you want to do something bright or white or black um, whatever color would suit you you can break the gray um, then with that so what I'll do is first I'm going to show you how to wear this um, if it is in summer or spring um, first need to get undressed first <laughs> or you again so yeah, again, I've got my woolly toppy on at the bottom, which I I think this is the item I wore the most during the lockdown, lockdown time. Um, there you go. You see, there you go. And it is for the in-between. Maybe a bit too um, warm for um, summer if you tend to, to get warm very easily. But it's a very soft, nice um material i think it's a mix between a cotton and um so it does crease you can see like that it creases quite then you know there's quite a lot of cotton um in the in the material but there you go there's the the top nice cut at the back but you must be careful when you wear something bulky like this at the top always go for something skinny i've got my skinnies on at the bottom just to um, give you a nice a slimmer look to the outfit or what you can do then is just do the tuck in. Um, so with this one, I have tried the belt. Let me just first show you. Um, I have tried it with the belt, but because of the flare arms, it is actually very uncomfortable. But I think with this one, one can. So your skinny people can also wear this one, but just change the design a little bit. So if you would do it with the belt, this is a nice belt I also bought now in Thailand. It's got different ways that you can actually wear it. So you see, it's not because I can't really move my arms. And even if I, you know, pull it out a little bit like that, there's just too much material for you to wear a belt around it. But what you can do is you can actually do a tuck. So I would do a full tuck here in front because it's also the cut is in front shorter than obviously at the back. So you can do it tuck like that and then you can just let it hang at the back and it's very very comfy. You can see it's quite a, um, it is maybe a little bit big so what you can do is if you love the top and it is too big for you, you can just you know alter it and take it in maybe a little bit like that on the inside or you can wear something around your neck to try and hide the, um, the fact that it's a bit too big for you there. What we're going to do now is we're going to change it into a winter outfit. Oh, oh no. <laughs> I'm going to change it into my winter outfit. In winter, I love wearing polo necks. Um, you can actually put everything, anything over it, or just a jacket. So, I've got my polo neck on. At one stage, I also mentioned I do love more of a messy look when you put your Polo neck on. So now I'm warming up and I'm going to change my shirt to more of a winter. 
and the material actually allows it to be worn in winter as well. If it's going to be like a linen, I don't think that's going to be a nice, comfy uh, material to wear in winter time. So there we go. We've got this underneath. You can do your the cream color um, polar neck. You can do um, white. You can do black. I'll just add this gray one on today. So then what I'll do again is I'll do the half tuck in the front. Just pull it out like that. Ooh, this looks quite nice. And then just need to maybe zoosh it up a bit. So I'm going to do some jewelry to this one. Um, with this, you can actually go a little bit dramatic on your jewelry. You can go your single if you're a single girl um, and you prefer your single. Um, I'm in the mood for a little bit more than just one. And this being a dramatic top, you can actually get away with going a little bit more dramatic with your jewelry. And there you go. And there you've chosen. And you've also break, you broke the solidness of the gray because otherwise it's just too much um, grayness happening. You can choose if you want to maybe do gold or silver. I'm sure you can do, hmm, let's see if you can do black. I've got this neck piece here. So if I want to do, let's see if I want to do the black. Ah, I don't know. To me, it's a bit too long. I would prefer it maybe a bit shorter if you would do... You know, like a black neck piece or something, then I would prefer it a bit shorter. This one is maybe maybe a bit too long, but also uh, it depends on what mood you are. Um, then you can do this one. I will, uh, I think you can do silver to silver gold that is also very in fashion. Um, a mixture of silver and gold. You could actually. No, maybe do something like this as well. I just like the idea of doing the brown. To me, it just works with this outfit. Put on correctly, and then it will be difficult to put something to put a jacket or something on over it because of the flareness of the sleeves, and you'll just be uncomfortable. So what I would then advise is rather to put something on underneath, more like a VC or something, and then obviously you can do your scarf. And you're nice and warm and you're ready to go. So now you could actually wear your top in um, springtime and in wintertime. There you go, guys. Just a quick one. What to do with your shirt in two seasons. Um, enjoy it. Have a wonderful week. Um, and stay safe. Good to chat to you again.